Today we're going to do a redemption run with Fauna. I failed miserably with her last time, but I think it's because it's stage four and also I just haven't been powering myself up enough. So let's jump in and um, do a little bit more powering up through selling fish, making some money, and then going back into stage four here. Here we go. You don't believe everything you see in YouTube shorts? What's wrong with you? You're supposed to. Just kidding. Yeah, don't believe everything you see online. <laughs> I think that's a that's a good rule of thumb to have. So I'm just going to sell most of my fish. This is from me getting the golden rod. I, uh, I did a lot of fishing to get the golden rod and I, I didn't sell all the fish I had. I didn't sell most of the fish I had actually. So let's see how much this is all going to be. I do want to save some of it just in case I want to cook some food, but I haven't been doing any of the farming. So axolotls, what happens when you give an axolotl an AK-47? You might've seen that in one of my other videos. So I almost have 300 K. Um, I'm still going with the shrimp tempura, I guess, at least for now. I'll check out the other food later. Okay, so let's do the growth at... Hey, I forgot to get myself the money. Go back in here. We're doing exchange. I think I'm just going to do it all. I don't see why not. I don't need sand anymore. Get the heck out of here. And then go to the shop. Go to the upgrades. Stat upgrades. Wait, no. I wanted this one. Alright, that's 50k gone already. I should get some rerolls, shouldn't I? I'll get three. Oh, eliminates here too. I'll take two of those maybe. And then I will, damage is always good. I'll get a couple of those. Speed is good. Critical rate is fine. Enchantment rate up or enhancement rate up is not super important for me. Maybe we'll get some of this. Might as well just max it out. Uh, pickup range, sure. Wait, where's the EXP? Yeah, I wanna max that out. Increase the rate food is dropped. Yeah, we might as well max that out. Defense, max that out. Slowly heals, max that out. Attack speed, sure. Is that important? Oh man, these are getting expensive, aren't they? I'll take a couple of these. I'll take one more of you, two more. A little bit more speed. What is this again? Crit chance, do we wanna max that out? I'll take some more attack speed before I max that out. All right, let's just spend it on this. Now we are all strengthened up. Let's go back in with Fauna. Sage mode, we're going Sage 4 here. <sighs> we have Tempura up and running. She is not the greatest attack character. She's more of a defensive character, so maybe the Tempura can help supplement that. <laughs> uh oh <laughs> don't mention only fans on my stream <laughs> see jack has a problem with it <laughs> let's go nature shield level two <laughs> do you mean the game jack or do you mean the chat let's take sapling I'm wondering. Like, we all know what's going on on OnlyFans, but like, is there any normal content on um, OnlyFans? Like, do people make like safe for work stuff there, or is it purely for not safe stuff? And Jack, this is Hollow Cure which is a fan-made game for Hollow Live stuff, if you know what that is. Apply the stamp to the weapon. What does it do? Right, we have a bomb stamp. So it's like Vampire Survivors meets Hollow Live, if you know what those things are. I'll take the credit card for sure.
Oh, thank you, Jack. That's so nice. Yeah, I wouldn't be doing this without all you viewers and all you subscribers, so this is for you. Okay, what do we want? I guess I'll take the Guardian Tree early. I do need to heal before that does anything. Um, my favorite healing sources are... Like, Nurse's Horn would be good on this girl, and also the Bandage, I think. I'm not sure if I love the Uber Sheep on her. But Uber Sheep has some kind of like super, super collab, so a lot of people suggest it. I'm not gonna even think about that. Oh yes, we know Pikmin. <laughs> oh yes, we know. All right, I think so far seems pretty easy. Look at this astronaut, dude. It looks like Stewie from Family Guy, but like astronaut version. Uh, I'm going to take the Whisper so we can get some healing stuff going on. Oh my god, he's touching me! No, Stewie! No, Stewie! <laughs> That's not Stewie. Someone's going to tell me who that what character that is or whatever it's gonna be totally wrong i'll take nature shield here credit card let's go Whew. all right psycho axe remember what happened last time when you use too much of your mom's credit card uh i died undertale the RPG, Undertale. Um, no, but I, I know it was like really popular a couple of years ago, right? Like three or four years ago. Is it still like expanding and is there more content for that? And why do you mention it? Hey, Mighty Mojo! I don't love Fauna as a character, but she she has some stuff going for her that maybe I'm not using correctly. I'll say that much. I personally like more offensive characters. Like Bay was really cool. I really like the shark girl. I can't remember her name right now. Do not get greedy again. But I want the credit card. Check this out, Pikmin. Credit card. <laughs> it's one of the best games of all time. Okay. Based on whose opinion? Uh, probably a lot of people's, actually. <laughs> yeah, her attack is not my favorite. You don't have a lot of control over it, but maybe you're not. Hey, Pikmin, check it out. I'm going to use the credit card anvil to level up my credit card. <gasps> Lol. Another sticker. This one is increase 5% for every empty weapon slot. I guess it works well for now. People have said it's pretty good. Hey, you might you might be right, Pikmin. I mean, I might. Credit card level five, there we go. The good news is that's a max level, so we don't need to look, look at the credit card anymore. I'm gonna die anyways. I mean, honestly, I'm not that great at this game. <laughs> I'm good at the fishing thing, evidently. Oh, squirrel time. Wait, we haven't used her special a single time. Maybe I'll use it. Yeah, so her special makes her invulnerable, so you can just step in front of people's faces and just smash them, but... I still don't think I like it that much. Oh, I really liked Mori, too. Mori was nice. At some point, I'll be able to give you a comprehensive list of my favorite characters, but right now I have less than half of them unlocked. I do have a Nintendo Switch. I, I was playing Dead Cells on it. Um, there might be some games I play from Switch. I don't know which ones I should play on Switch, to be honest. 
CEO, CEO's Tears is really good, but just bandages here, and I did talk about liking it. We're going to do Nature Shield to do five total leaves. No, it's more than that. Look at all these saps. All the saplings. Pokemon. Have you guys heard of Pokemon Infinite Fusion? Because I've been thinking about playing that on the channel, but it'd be really different than what I usually do. <laughs> Same here, Mighty Mojo. I, I'm i learning all of my knowledge of Hollow Live from all of the comments and all of the chatter that happens on my channel, which honestly has been great because I'm learning it gradually. Um, and it's the things that you all think is important for me to know. <laughs> Which has been working out really well, so I really appreciate everyone watching it and commenting and providing information and all that kind of stuff. Whoa! Pokemon Scarlet, it's the one that you played. I bet it's good. Uh, Pokemon... Do you mean Pokemon Infinite Fusion, Pikmin? This reminds me of mobile games without the ads. <laughs> it is also a free game, Jack, just to let you know. So it's like the best type of mobile game you can get. No ads, completely free, and a whole bunch of content. I haven't got a super collab, Phoenix. I have been told about the combinations that I need to make them, but they all escape out of my brain really quick. I think Uber Sheep is one of them, Gorilla Paw someone told me about, but I'm just gonna chill out and do whatever. If I can win without them, then I'm just going to do that. But eventually, if I get into a stage where it's like, yo, you got to use super collabs to win. I guess at that point, I'm going to have to start using them. But I'm still a noob in this game. Like, I, I don't have most of the characters unlocked. I haven't unlocked a lot of things, too. Pokemon Crown is a super interesting one. It is like medieval setting. That's pretty neat. How did they make the Pokemon different in it. Is it different Pokemon at all? Or is it just the the setting and stuff like that that's different? Alright, Jack. <laughs> Am I putting you to sleep? 1am, whoa. No, I get it. There's a lot of people out there that need to watch something before falling asleep. That's not me personally. I need complete silence and complete darkness to sleep usually, but sometimes if I'm not exactly tired yet, I'll watch something and then lull myself into bed. Pokemon are all the same. Got you. Oh, a demo. You have to pay for a mod? Increases attack size. That might help. We do have piercing leaves here. Which one do I not love? I don't love solo stamp. I'm, I'm planning on filling everything up. Uh, let's strengthen it, sure. Oh, there's an anvil. ROM hack is actually two human. All different Pokemons. New moves, new bosses, and new map. Oh, so they just used... The Pokemon game as like a base from the sounds of it and they just create their own thing. I get a whole bunch of articles through my phone about Pokemon ROM hacks. The only one that has really interested me is Infinite Fusion because I love Monster Collection that is that has fusion in it. And speaking of Switch games, there is the Monster... What is it? The Dragon Quest Monsters... I think the new one is called like Joker or something like that. I might play that one because it is, I do like Dragon Quest the series. I haven't played one in a while, but that one always has fusion. So I really think that it might appear on the channel at some point. It is a little bit, again, different than what I'm doing usually because I do roguelites almost exclusively, but we could play some roguelites and then have a series for like a monster collection game like Pokemon, a ROM hack, or do the 
monster, the Dragon Quest monster thing as well. It's a lot harder. Well, I'm not that great at games sometimes, so I'm not sure if I'm into that. Pokemon Fusion, you might run into Pokemon called... Shit. <laughs> that sounds like a funny Pokemon. Um, BL Book plus size is good. Oh god, I'm gonna get some comments on that thing that I just said. <laughs> but BL Book with this particular enchantment is good. <laughs> Yikes. Oh, I do like Super Mario RPG. Sea of Stars. I've heard of that one. Oh, you know what? They are doing a re-release of Super Mario RPG, right? I absolutely love that game when it came out. And I would love to play it again. So that might appear on the channel too. I think that a lot of people would tune in for that one as well. It's such a great game. But Sea of Stars, I have been seeing some, um, some articles and, and stuff about that. But what do you like about it exactly? I would I'd love to hear your thoughts on why it's taking up so much of your time. Where have I seen that? Is that on Steam? Or is that a Nintendo Switch thing? Yeah, I can see that combination having that, that name. That's a hilarious name, by the way. Like, that, that's worthy of being an inside joke <laughs> type of thing and getting dropped here and there in a conversation with your friends. It's that type of name. Uh, let's do... I'm going to upgrade her stuff early this time. I'll take the BL book here. Fan beam 2, not bad. Do I have gear? I don't have the blacksmith gear. Oh, another one. Let's keep going. Ian's Curse, everyone has been saying this is amazing. I haven't seen it shine just yet, but I'll pick it up because everyone's all like, yo, one of the best weapons in the game. As you can all tell, I'm just picking up stuff kind of randomly. Oh, I love pixel art, as everyone could probably tell from the games I play. Oh, cool. Is it like... Is it kind of open world, choose your own adventure type of like, you go where you want, you recruit the characters you want or something like that? Or is it more on rails where you it's like you play through the story and you do what the game puts you on rails for kind of thing that like it's the same for everybody? If you understand my question. Like, do you, do you get to choose where you go in that game and you make your own path? Or is it more rigid in terms of the way that the story progresses? I guess Super Mario RPG and Chrono Trigger were on rails, right? <laughs> so if it's similar to that, then... Uh, yeah, it's more linear. That's the word I was looking for. You read my mind. <laughs> okay, I got you. Uh, let's do Ian's Curse. Where did you see that? Meet the Engineer text appears. Huh? Oh. Oh man, these zombies. I will say this seems a lot easier than the last time I played Stage 4 with Fauna. But I also pumped like 300k into the store, so... You gotta get something for 300k. Please move. Da 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 da. Oops. I have. I see what you mean. So it's linear. Still cool. 
if the gameplay is good and the battle system's good and the characters are cool and you can fall in love with them, there's nothing more you can really ask for. That means the world is full of areas that mean something. Yes, you're right. Guardian Tree level 2. Oh, we got a collab. I don't remember any of them, so... It's the Endless BL book or whatever, isn't it? Yeah. I've actually had that one, like, for the last five runs I've done. I've made that collab every single time. Not on purpose. Oh, God. Please stop hurting me. I deserve love. Oh, my God. I'm getting wrecked. Oh, my goodness. I think this is the bear that keeps killing me, too. The zombie bear? Okay. Alright, what do I need? Study glasses could still give us a little bit of value. I, I, I feel like I only get to level 50-something usually, though. <laughs> okay, what, what's going on here? Jack says, hey, look, buddy, I'm an engineer. That means I solve problems, not problems like what is fashion. I solve practical problems. Good. The combat is really fun with everyone having a different element. The combos are a lot of fun. Ooh, combos. Love it. Without playing it or seeing it in action, it's a little bit difficult to explain. That's fair. <laughs> hey, uh, Pikmin, let's do it uh, after this run. Oh my god! I like this mounted tripod machine build? But Are you talking about butts, Jack? Oh, okay! What's this one? I'm not sure if I've ever found this one. Decrease the damage of the main weapon, but speed of character is increased. No thanks. It's just, I, I have to focus on this Pikmin. I don't know if I'm going to survive if I had to solve a brain teaser right now. But I do like the riddles. Oh man, there's more elites. Ugh. What's going on? <laughs> what? I don't even know what's going on in the chat right now. Okay, I'm getting hurt. Uh, I want this to be enchanted. Give me a good one. Size plus 15. I don't know if that's helpful for EN's curse, but we're going to try it. D&D? &D? Oh my god, have fun! Have the most fun, Mighty Mojo. I'm so jealous. I wish I had some D&D &D campaigns going on. But yeah, see you later. Yeah, D&D &D would be cool. I've only played it once, and it was only one session, and we never picked it back up ever again, because that group of people that I started with never got together ever again to, to even hang out, even if it wasn't D&D. &D. Yeah, it just kind of fell apart. A little bit sad. But, um, yeah, I, I do miss it. Ugh. Hold on one sec. Are you still talking about guns, Jack? <laughs> I assume so. Is this a tripod gun that you're talking about? Team Fortress 2? I don't get the reference. I never played it. Don't hate me. Sorry. <laughs> what? Okay, I read the top of that message, Pikmin, and you know what? That that looks a little bit weird right now. Oh, I should have taken the study glasses. How do you get that backward S? Oh wait, that's not a backward S. It just looks weird on the screen. Ian's curse. I 
I think we're gonna make it this time, everybody. I mean, I don't want to get confident at 13 minutes, but we're kind of crushing it here. Study glasses, give me that. I think it's good what we've done because if we we picked up the nurse's horn, which gives us a lot of healing triggering off, which triggers her branch thing, and then every time we get hit, the bandage also heals us over time. Oh wait, I should level up the study glasses. Smart, right? Because that way we just get a bunch of XP. Look at this. Oh! It's a happy Saturn. Or just a happy planet. Or it's a happy cloud. I don't know. Please move. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm getting shot at. Or was that me shooting? I don't know what's happening. All right, we we got some interesting characters in terms of like letter characters in the chat here. All right, let's do max out Ian's curse. I've never done a collab with Ian. Ooh, I've never done a collab with Ian's curse. I also haven't used Fauna's alt at all. Hey, look at that blacksmith's gear. Heck yes, I'm gonna take that. Oh, we got a Redditor. Ouch. Ouch. I'll take Fan Beam. Ouchie. Lots of stuff getting shot at me. Is that Ian's curse bouncing around everywhere? Because I thought that was an enemy projectile because it was coming towards my direction here and there. But I guess it's bouncing between enemies. Uh oh. Hey there, buddy, pal, chum, pal, buddy, friend, amigo, pal. What? If you take one more. Whoa! <laughs> Average angry Texan. Is this what you hear day to day? Jack, are you living in Texas? Don't worry, this is this is not Texas in this stream, that's for sure. I have never said that to anyone in my life, at least. <laughs> not how I say hello. Uh, wow, we're all maxed out. I mean... I guess I'll do Nature Shield. I need some more weapons. Maybe there's a collab within the future, within the near future. Do you live in Texas? Or are you just slinging some Texas slang up in here? It might even be from a video game, I have no idea. Really, Phoenix? Do you bank on getting the empty slot sticker every single time then because I feel like that's a huge risk to take a gamble and not get the sticker whoops I like using multiple weapons too much to try that right now but maybe in the future why am I dead that's not cool all right. We can all have a weird character contest. Let's see what's going on here. We have Lava Bucket. I guess it's cho chosen one of the weapons that we're going to use. I'll use a CEO CEO's tears as well. Okay, you need to max out bonus stats first. Yeah, probably. Uh, I think I'll take CEO's tears. Please stop hurting. Oh, no way. Don't kill me. Thank God we have so much healing. Oh wait, her ult will also make her invincible. So if I'm, if I'm feeling like in trouble, I should really just use it. Can someone drop an anvil? Like what? 
What's the problem here? What's the hold up? Oh, I heard one. It's not golden. Piece of poop. Oh, right. I can use it twice. All right, I'm about to drop a huge tree. Nope. I'll survive. We're going to make it. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm so close. Sadly, we only have one collab, though. Whoa! Minecraft... Din... Wait... Minecraft anvil noise. Oh, I see. <laughs> I don't even know what that sounds like. Everyone's gonna hate me here, too, but I, I actually didn't play too much Minecraft. I'm assuming the sound goes ka-chunk. Uh-oh. <laughs> I hope that's not a reaction to what I just said. Oh, what? Deep breath. Oh, we were so close. Okay, get the controller out. We're retrying. We got it this time, though. Nice. How often do you do a session for D&D? &D? Like once a week? I want to know your cadence. The problem that I have with trying to start a D&D &D crew is that no one wants to be DM and I feel like that's fine to feel that way because you really do need a good DM to have a good time with it. Like it's a it's a skill to be a DM. You know what I mean? It's kind of like being a goalie, I guess. It's just like a role that not everyone likes to play or more commonly people don't like playing that role but people who really love it are really good at it and they always want to play goalie kind of thing okay two weeks on one week off oh got you jack with the tf2 references what am i taking here let's take the sapling so that i can get some speed boost speed boost is important Uh, I don't like any of this. I'll take Whisper, though. Whisper. What's this thing? Is that a little sushi thing? Sashimi? Whatever. Sashimi? Uh-oh. Clouds are coming in. Oh, dodge. More levels, please. I want those e- Oh, I can re-roll. I totally forgot. Let's re-roll. I mean, I don't care for too much of this. Let's re-roll again. Let's eliminate something. Uh, I'll probably eliminate the plushie. What happens when that happens? Oh, okay. It just disappears. Um, what does this do? Maybe I'll re-roll again. That's all my re-rolls already. Oh, I don't like any of these. I guess I'll take the spider cooking, though. You've had DMs that struggle. Yeah, I would struggle. The group can make it more fun. Oh, I missed the rest of that. Alright, let me try to get back to that. The group can make it more fun. I'm gonna die. Let me just get a level up, and I'm gonna check out what you said here. More fun, but when you are being railroaded, it can get boring. Yeah, especially when all suggestions get brushed off. <laughs> Jack, you you are an interesting person. Um, let's take the guardian tree here. So yeah, I, I can see that. Like, I guess a DM, a bad DM, could 
totally power trip and be like, no, I'm going to not let you do anything and I'm definitely going to destroy everyone in this group. Like that, that must be a thing that happens, right? Uh, and that would not be fun. Because it's a mix of like trying to get your story through, but also letting people be creative and imaginative. Which one do I hate here? I don't like stolen piggy bank. I'm going to take the headphones this time. Go a little defensive. Oh, oh. That was the uh, headphones, I think. Get me out of here. Ouch. All right, let's see what we got. Maybe do a nature shield again. Nurse's horn, I really do think works well with her. <laughs> Pikmin. I'm surprised you don't have like an encyclopedia of them. All right. Oh, we got some more DM stuff coming from Mighty Mojo. Let me take a look at that. The DM I had would just make a story showcase the other characters they made. Oh, made it all about them. That's not good. So we would always just get close to a team wipe just to have him over have an overpowered come in to save the day. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> uh, that might sound mean, but like, what's the comparison of that? I don't know. It's just like someone that always talks about things, asks you questions, but then turns around that conversation and makes it about themselves. Um, like granted, maybe some of us do that by accident sometimes, but there's, there's probably a better comparison to that situation that you uh, just described there. But yeah, that, that is a, a screaming, hey, remember this awesome thing that I did? That's funny though. I guess if they create their character strong enough, they can save any situation. It's like someone who can teleport through walls, can fly, can kill everything in one hit type of thing. That's great. <laughs> I'm sorry that happened to you, Mighty Mojo, but that's kind of funny now, now that I think about it. <laughs> Alright, get this Redditor out of here, please. Is it just me, or are we way weaker than last time? You know why? Because we haven't got a million credit cards yet. Alright. Oh, study glasses! You know I love study glasses. Oh, God! Ouch. Okay, maybe I'll use my ult. You see, everyone, I do know how to use an ult. <laughs> All of you forget, but I actually do know what button to press to do it. Credit cards, devil faces. Everyone loves a good credit card. Let's do the Awakened version here. It does way more damage now that it does its targeting attack or whatever. Study glasses, definitely. What the? This guy's shaking a lot. Oh, is this a... What, what is this? Um, info, please. Why was it going crazy? I guess super... The super behind it is making it awesome. Gain 30% crit, but aiming direction becomes slightly unstable. I think that's fine. My lucky day. Holozon is part of everybody's lucky day. So it doesn't take up. Oh, it does take up. Wait, how come there's a counter in the bottom right hand corner or bottom left hand corner for the super sake? I, I'm not sure what's happening here. Let's take a whisper level two. No! What's no all about? Did I do something wrong? Do 
there is a small chance to get upgrading item cards. Huh? I'll take the nurse's horn level two. No credit cards. Oh, I see what you mean. But credit card is such a good item. Isn't it? More anvils equals more everything. I personally think it's amazing. There's no better combination than some super sake and a credit card. <laughs> but now I have sake, so maybe the sake will help me survive with the credit card. Man, I have no weapons. What's wrong with me? I'll enchant you. Credit card OP, exactly. Spider cooking plus size, sounds good. We can eat even bigger tarantulas. Do. All right, I have two spaces left for accessories or whatever they're called. I personally still want the credit card. <laughs> I don't know what the other one should be though. I have headphones already, right? Yes, I do. I'll just do spider cooking though. Excuse me. Sapling. Oh, study glasses is here. Yeah, it's the blacksmith's gear. That would be nice too, but I have limited space. If I go blacksmith's gear, I definitely have to save the last space for the credit card. Ugh, I want the study glasses, but the the lava bucket is here. Now I'll just take the study glasses. Whatever. Oh, zombie time. Get out of the way. Sick. That was a lot of zombies. I wasn't sure if I was going to make it through there. Spider cooking level three. No, nope. we're doing study glasses again. We got study glasses early this time. Oh, we got the slow redditor. We got the slow down redditor. Okay. Please go away. There you go. Nope. Now he's gone. I kind of want the bandage. But I don't know if that's a good idea. I just feel like having a lot of healing sources on her works out really, really well. Alright, Jack. See you later. Thanks for joining in today. Go to sleep. I know it's super late over there. He's going to have some dreams of Team Fortress 2 tonight for sure. Of all his favorite quotes. 100%. <laughs> Just based on the things that he's said in this stream. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Oh man. Okay, so we have sp just bandages here. I don't know if we're going to get those anvil items this time. I'm going to take just bandage. Ouch. <laughs> to be honest, all credit cards can be deadly. Either to your financial status, or it can be thrown really, really hard and pokey in the eye. Either way, deadly. Please help. Uh, let's take the glow stick. I do need some more weapons. Let's see what Holazon's got for us this time. Maybe another super shaking thing. Uh, let's take the Whisper level 3. This one's a normal one. Let's take it. Hey! It's this dude. Give me cash. I think he dropped stickers too, which I have zero of, surprisingly. This one is a 10% chance to stun enemies and destroy enemy projectiles. I love it. 
Blacksmith's gear is here. Um, this is going to be the last run for today. So I guess, like, at most, another 20 minutes? But yeah, we're, we're running out of time today. Alright, Mighty Mojo, have the best time. Those are some good weekend plans, if you ask me. Let's do spider cooking level 5. Some zombies coming through. Why can't you eat ramen? I don't know what that's referencing. Maybe... Wait, why can't you eat ramen? <laughs> it's so delicious. How could you not? Alright, let's do this. Ah, oh, no! She ran out! Come back, come back. Yes, come into the death zone. Or rather, it's a life zone for me. Ouch! Oh, I see what you mean. What kind of ramen are you making? I want to make my own ramen, like make the uh, the soup myself. And then I guess the noodles you could make yourself, but I probably wouldn't do that. But if I could make my own broth, that would be amazing. I'm sure it's not too difficult to make a basic one. But I hope it would be good. But it's definitely been on my list of things that I wish I could cook myself. Because I do love ramen, but it's not cheap to get it from a restaurant. Chicken flavor. Nice. Oh! Oh! Too many enemies. I am slowly dying. I think I killed this Hello Kitty dude way faster last time. Okay, let's let's go do this. Good luck. Good luck surviving. Come here. Come here. Oh my god, I can't believe he's not dead yet. Ooh, a sticker. Please stop chasing me. I want the sticker. Let's do... Ooh, a full meal could be good. No, I'm just going to take a little stick. Alright, this does a reduction to attack and defense. Just love it. Could you... Please... Go away. Oh, this is what happened last time. We had two bosses on the screen. Alright, we're good to go. Holazon has given us an elite lava bucket. I I do like that one. Uh, I will take the glow stick. There's a part of me that still wants that credit card. It is a little bit late game for a credit card though. Uh oh. Oh, dodge. There's a lot of projectiles on this stage, so I'm kind of happy we have that first sticker that we got. Hey, what's this? Unit stamp. Decrease the damage of the main weapon by 30, ew, but increase the damage of all other weapons by 4%. I'm sure there's a use for this, but I don't like it. Sorry. Broken Baldman. <laughs> it definitely looks broken. It looks like a broken something. It's so weird that that shows up like that. Okay, let's do the glow stick level 6. Glow stick is max. 
Hollow on. Please level up something I have already. I'm not ready to take a new item. Yeah, let's take that. Our first anvil, or one of the first. Um, you're both maxed. You're awakened. Let's take the lava bucket. Sorry for my annoying singing, but the music in this game is just too good. I think we can make it. We'll be smarter than last time, right? I don't even know like what damage numbers would be considered strong in this game. Uh oh, zombies. I'm fine as long as there's no more zombie Hello Kitty coming through. Okay, what do we got here? I'll take the lava bucket. So I have the headphones as a defensive item, maybe... I'm wondering if that's good enough or maybe we can take another one. Hey, I remember you. Mr. Cloud Dude or whatever. Rainbow Saturn. What is this sticker? Okay, I'm gonna do this so I can pick up the sticker. It is the solo stamp. Not going to be super effective with us right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and merge it. All right, I'm running, I'm running. Thank goodness. Let me take the elite lava bucket. Level five is fine. <laughs> I mean, I can see the creeper colors from it, but again, just looks like a deconstructed mess. But in a way, that's how Minecraft looks like. Super blocky, just blocks the colors sitting beside each other. Oh. Okay, not taking Super Shadow. We'll max this out. I'm hoping for at least one collab. We'll see if it happens. We have five minutes to do it. Oh, that's a golden one. Look at that. I called it. I called it. Right. I have done this one before, I think. Have I? Elite cooking. Right. I have done it before. Uh oh. Uh oh. So we're going to put a bunch of poisonous blobs everywhere for everyone to enjoy. Please move. What am I hearing? I heard some dinging. Alright, is it time for a new weapon? I'm gonna take just bandage first. We'll see if we get an elite, not an elite one, uh, an enchanted weapon next. <laughs> Everyone keeps saying that, Phoenix. But, I don't know, that type of healing, I'm not... I don't like that type of healing. I just heard that it's part of a super collab, that's why you want to take it. What is that? It looks like a Batman belt, almost. What? What is that, Pikmin? It looks like a line with a blue square in the middle. But yeah, Uber Sheep, I, I personally don't like going around picking up hamburgers to heal because if you're in a pinch you don't want to walk around too much um, and yeah I think super bandage or just bandage is a better way to heal in my opinion I have no more rerolls dang uh, I guess I will take the plug J-Man Curly what is J-Man Curly but yeah 
Phoenix, are you just mentioning the Uber Sheep because of the super collab? Or is it the best way to heal? Interested to hear your opinion on that. Oh, I have Fan Beam? I almost have the super collab. I also almost have, only have like 13 minutes left. So the super collab is the food thing plus the uber sheep, I'm guessing, right? So it's spider cooking, lava bucket, plus uber sheep. All right, this is where I died last time. Weapon will fire backwards. Ew. Oh, I can't strengthen this. One second here. We're almost there. We're almost there. Level 50. What about level 50? Some characters have a specific buck buff from picking up food, so Uber Sheep works better on some characters than others. Oh, thanks, Philippe. Philippe. In level 50, the biggest gorilla tag YouTuber, J-Pan Curly. I don't even know what that means. Gorilla tag. Here's Uber Sheep. I don't know if I'm going to make it, but I will try. Just to try to get the super collab going. I'm guessing I have to get it all the way to level 5 as well. What is this, man? Jeez, Louise. Big wall of pirate penguins. Oh, they're flying everywhere now. I didn't know penguins can fly. All right, we're about to beat our PB from this stage. We're at like 18 minutes and 10 seconds. Oh no! Get me out of here. We can heal pretty fast, but if we get hit too frequently really fast, then we're gonna die. All right, we're gonna go Uber Sheep to try to get that super collab. Hey, we got the rainbow sticker. Doesn't do much for us, but I'm going to try it. The effect is pretty small on her weapon in particular. Or maybe it's because I turned the transparency down. Probably a mix of both. Ouch! Holy moly, man. This is getting nuts. Give me that burger. Get this penguin pirate out of here. <gasps> Anvil. Anvil time. I'm stuck. It's a normal anvil. We're gonna do uber sheep here to try to get it maxed out. There's another anvil, I heard it. Oh, there it is. Can I make it? I'm gonna do this. Uber sheep it up. We got the tree protecting us for now. I'm gonna walk to the holozon. Uh, sure. Fan beam? Yes. Let's go. <sighs> yeah, it's kind of a crazy stage. I have a minute left though. And then I have to fight whatever boss comes through. I don't know what it's going to look like. Ah! Can we make it? Someone drop a gold anvil or whatever the super collab looks like. Maybe it will be the saving grace. Oh, I think I got it. Y'all seeing this? Uh, I will take the fan beam. There is a hammer on the ground. I'm scared to walk in all of that though. Okay, I will try to get it then. Oh, there's so many enemies. I don't want to run into that. Ah, this is a bad idea. Ah, did No! What the heck is that? What is that golden hammer? I thought it would give me the super collab. Oh my god. That hurts even more. I was 20 seconds away from 20 minutes. My god. Info though? What is this golden hammer? You know? Is that supposed to be the super collab? 
Or do I have to like use it a certain way? Who knows? Okay, well, anyways, that's going to be it for today. I, I let Fauna down for sure. Golden Hammer allows you to make Super Collab on the Golden Anvil. Okay, I see. I see. Well, that's going to be it for today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it here. Leave a like if you did. Remember to subscribe as well. Would really love your support for the channel. And if there's anything you want to see on the channel, please leave a comment on the video as well. We'll be back with some more Hollow Cure very, very soon. So stay tuned. Thanks for joining in. Peace out, everybody. Peace.